Hello guys, what's up? Do you recognize this face? This is Hamilton Drove, a young smart businessman and tenderpreneur. He had been ordered to pay back 158 million rands he made through PPE tenders in 2020. Is this another example of flexing gone wrong? Hamilton has been on the news since 2020. This is because when people were losing job and hitting rock bottom in 2020 due to the pandemic, Hamilton was buying supercars. That was a really big flex and it brought him the wrong attention. And unfortunately, not everything was so smooth with his finances. Hamilton acquired his millions in a very manipulative way. Here's what he did. Hamilton scored tenders worth 172 million rands to supply the NHLS with PPE. To achieve this, he registered 19 companies that competed against each other during the bidding process. After the investigation, it was discovered that not only did he not disclose that he was part of the 19 companies, it was also revealed that only 15 million rands was used to purchase and provide PPE to the NHLS. The prices he presented during bidding were outrageous, but it was all good because he was only competing with himself. Unfortunately, Hamilton brought all these investigations and problems to himself by posting his wealth on Instagram. Hamilton bought five supercars worth 11 million rands in one day and post them on Instagram in the middle of the pandemic. In the short video clip, he said the Porsche Panamera was for the children and the Lamborghini Urus will be used to go buy bread. Like I said, this short video clip triggered the events that followed and the rest is history. I don't think Hamilton is the only one who got the opportunity to abuse the pandemic tenders and capitalize on a very dark period in the country. But I'm asking myself, if he didn't post his wealth on Instagram, do you think we would be here today? Do you think he was gonna be investigated? Maybe he should have bought it at least one supercar per month or he should have stayed off social media tell me what you think about a milton story i'm also finding it a bit disappointing that it's so easy to finesse the state for tenders do you think he pulled this off alone either way i can't believe it Thank you so much for watching this video if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet please subscribe if you have already subscribed to the channel please turn on notifications if you have already turned on notifications you're awesome and i want you to know that i appreciate you thank you see you in the next video